the cool. You always go for press conferences when we fight each other as musicians, which does not benefit your child who goes to school where there is a, a kid who has tuberculosis. And you know how tuberculosis is transformed from one person to another. It is by coughing in air, and another person inhales. So, if Godoku can come out and send the Kanuane Urutalu, I am asking you kindly, and I'm on my knees asking the media fraternity, if you have a movie, you can the question would be, maybe be cool Uranga, I definitely know your young people and you work, you've got families and you've got, uh, you know, goals. You know me, I'm very straightforward when it comes to issues. This is what I'm going to say. I had to impress these rich men before they sent my proposal into acceptance. Okay? I first do my work and then I demand. Because it is now very difficult to prove to anyone that you can do work. Give me money and I do work. That aspect is also gone. As much as we know there is a new era coming up in life, we should also accept certain things that will work. One of the things that I'm going to ask the media fraternity of Uganda on tuberculosis and baby cool. I don't know about the rest, but my goal here is tuberculosis. If I can get 400,000 shillings alone as baby cool, after I lobbied for it for one year, $400,000, how about, and I've been given this $400,000 to use for 12 months, but I've been given a target, and if I achieve that target, the next one is $2 million. So this $2 million, if I achieve that target, the next one is five. Okay? So, my question here is, do you want some money? As media? Me, I'm open. Let's see some hands of anyone who wants. But I, when I finish here, if you don't put your hand up, I walk. I know there's a list going around, but if I finish here, if I don't see your hand, I go. Do you want some money? Do you want some money, media people? Good. Now here is the answer. Bovala mo musala go. No la ba miyes kumi nevi go inzo kukuwe la way good. Na yate using team between zo kukuwa mo imelundi esatu. So if you can join me and we drive, we drive this tuberculosis issue in Uganda for twelve months at your personal will. Bana mnyambe tu se tu lete tu sento kuvambazo tu zilete Uganda. I have been speaking in two languages so that this point can get in clear. To Jayo Kusenta, Vasaja Vat, to Alako Descent, Mungeri Endala, companies, so many uh, uh, you know, uh, foreign co companies are coming in here uh, to invest. But the actual thing is, yes, we want the investment, but they take money. Okay? But we need to bring back that money. Huh? Export labor and bringing back cash funding. To follow up a ferry. Next year. Let's make a mission. Let's go for the money to fight tuberculosis and end it in Uganda. We can get that money in less than two years. Two years puts us in a position where media fraternity no longer has just to pick news but also give back to the people. It is just another way of being an old person or cooler. No money until time has come. I also have a stake on my country. Thank you so much. Uh, definitely, I know I'll come back later because we have other issues. Many rules of India. Our Geneva office and the partners here in Uganda to look amongst you people who could represent you as a champion for TV. It was the most difficult task I've ever had. 
Um, for us, we are more of academic. As doctors, we relate more with the patients. We never relate with celebrities. And uh, I asked around, actually, I asked some of your media houses, which person could we take on as a TV champion in this country? And we are looking for somebody who could appeal to the ladies, especially, and the gentlemen at the same time. We didn't know how to do it. We looked towards the ladies. The list was long. We looked towards the gentlemen. The list was long, and we kept narrowing it down, and it eventually narrowed it to Bebe Cool. Can you clap for Bebe Cool? And good enough, all our partners accepted him. When I approached him, I called him personally. And uh, he received my call without any hesitation. He came to my office, we discussed. I didn't know that uh, he could be that humble. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, when I explained to him what we want to do, he accepted readily. So we worked on uh, uh, a journey to go to, and we had a very short time. We had less than one month to process visas, to go to New York, to attend the highest level meeting on tuberculosis. When I talk about high level meeting, we are talking about the presidents in the whole world. Prime Minister, leaders of government. So we traveled with the Bebe Cole, Within his schedules, he had put aside the, his schedules. And when we reached Geneva, they were really impressed with, I mean, when we reached uh, New York, they were really impressed with the call. And he was to sing to the leaders in this world in what they called the Night of Stars. I can assure you, Bebe Cole show, uh, stole the show that night. Because he was given 15 minutes, but I remember him being on stage for 30 minutes. He was singing and dancing with the leaders, the, the leaders you know, of the world leaders, and everybody was impressed. Thank you, Bebe. So, we have a journey. We have a task with you people a task to end tuberculosis in this world and Uganda in particular by 2030. The mission is not easy, but we must accomplish it. This is an old ancient disease. We can't continue having it around. It's very annoying that it's an ancient disease that has been with us hundreds of years, but more people are aware about HIV than tuberculosis. HIV has been here just for a few years. So, how can we leave our people in the communities unaware of tuberculosis? And how do we get to them? We can only get there through you people. And I'm, that's why I said I'm extremely happy because you are the voice, our voice. We've been looking for partners, and Bebe has done it for us this morning. He has brought you together. We must teach the people what are the causes of tuberculosis. How does one get infected with the tuberculosis? I'm sure all of you know that uh, tuberculosis is an airborne disease. Somebody coughs, jams up flowing around, now crowded as we are here. If somebody comes and has tuberculosis, I mean, if, if anybody can inhale in the tuberculosis. So, tuberculosis, anybody, whether you're a press person, whether you're a celebrity like Bebe, whether you are a dignitary, you can acquire tuberculosis. You can acquire it from here, you can acquire it from the plane, you can acquire it from the taxi, you can acquire it on the bus. And the first point is to get the information to the people. People must be knowledgeable about tuberculosis. And when they are knowledgeable, they should know. In case you suspect yours, what do you do? How do you get diagnosed of tuberculosis? Huh? 
all our health centers in this country, especially health center to upwards, and things are done. And we found that uh, the journey that I have taken of music for the last 25 years in Uganda has proven fruitful. Right now, everything in the world is kind of close to entertainment, if you want it to be successful. Be it politics, be it uh, health, be it uh, whatever, name it. Every time you bring it close to the music world, it becomes successful. So definitely the mother of all will be music. So, ladies and gentlemen, this year has been one of my best years, um, I would say musically, where definitely I feel I have not been touched and neither am I going to be touched for the next few days before the year ends musically. I have never felt threatened anyway as an artist and um, uh, the songs have been perfectly done. The world, uh, the, the country and the world all together have re uh, received my music well. Uh, of late, uh, definitely, uh, we've had the biggest song in the country which seems to be blocking me from releasing more music because my fans are still saying, don't release, where we are still, you know, penetrating and doing good. So I'm very proud to say that uh, I have done my part and, uh, and, and I think I deserve to be the best artist of this year. What do you think? Because I think this is a song that plays, you know, five to eight times every night in any bar on radio and TV. Uh, of course, credit goes to a management of Gagamel, who are making sure that quality becomes an issue. Years ago, when we had fights with DJs, actually, I had a partial uh, feeling. Usually what happens to Bebe Cool is, even if you don't like me or even if you're fighting me, I look for something that caused that fight on your side. So I really, really wanted to know why the DJs were saying all the things they were saying. Because still we were more successful than DJs. So my question at that time was, why are these people who are not as successful as us saying we are wrong? Kumbe, their issue was not about success. Their issue was even to make us more successful. To help us even walk a clearer road. And I must say, my extra success now comes because of DJs. Please, I want to thank all Ugandan DJs for the fight they put up. Because after that, I noticed that actually doing quality music was important. Mastered music and good videos. And today, Uganda enjoys Bebe Cool's videos and the sounds because the DJs fought for that. And they put us on a platform where now I rarely hear Nigerian music in the country, in the clubs. It is now more Ugandan music. When Bebe Cool does those videos, what happened is even the other artists who did not fly to go do videos from abroad, even their quality started stepping up. Even the directors who have never even seen a play have brought videos out that are closer to mine. Let me say I shoot my videos from abroad. I've done in the US, I've done in South Africa, but there are directors who have not gone anywhere, but they have done videos that are nearly as good as mine. So credit goes to the fraternity of the DJs. Um, this year we're ending the year with, of course I did not have a concert this year. Uh, as I told you that I will always do a concert every after two years. So we have a Golden Heart concert next year. I'll be communicating on the dates, uh, which will go back to Kololo. And uh, this one will be definitely and directly tagged to tuberculosis. Uh, we intend to collect the, mass, the, the, the biggest amount of monies ever in Uganda. I also want to send a clear message and uh, a request to the government of Uganda and the president of the country that for the first time, or oh, actually let me not exclude the members of parliament, who this is directly, you know, um, uh, directly targeted. I want to challenge the government of Uganda and the members of parliament who sit in parliament every day. We always have campaigns and there's a big budget of campaigns from our national budget, isn't it? But what has the electoral commission done with that money in return for the people when it comes to health? I mean, just imagine the next elections having a theme of a health that is attached to health. I mean, imagine Ngabri Muntuye na again part of 
elections are you gonna continue a means a yes at those three months won't uganda you're not what will date to gamble tv what does that take we keep on sending members of parliament mu parliament and they cannot come up with such simple ideas i'm not challenging anybody but i'm saying i am going to write to uh, 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 madam speaker in saba meeting nae okumunyonyola we need to tag a health aspect campaign is joining abantu banji abantu ne basiba wo batu yana there's so much contact within these events so how about if there's a health aspect on those events so that is one of the other ways on how a musician has had a lot of hit songs so this time our song is our Tony Ketchwat is called Heat After Heat because we have all the musicians with big songs and um, after a very long time for the first time we're also going to host uh, my brother my young brother Eddie Kenzo uh, who are definitely we are very happy and I'm personally very happy that I'm hosting him in Chwakwe for the first time I'm looking forward to my fans embracing him and you know I'm happy that whatever was going on between Eddie Kenzo and Bebe Cool is all gone. And this is what is important about life, time. Time solves a lot of things. Katukuze and we can work together and we can work for each other. So uh, I want to send a, a, thank, a thank you message for Eddie Kenzo, to Eddie Kenzo for accepting to end this and also to embrace I definitely went for his concert because I wanted this to go away because I can do a lot for him and he can do a lot for me. So he's coming over and I'm very glad that uh, both sides of the fans are happy and genuinely. And I want to ask Gagamel family members to embrace Eddie Kenzo. All over China, more to it, to Embrace my young brother because I think he has worked for it and he has earned his uh, respect and he has contributed to the music industry. So 26th of December will be boxing day. Kwa ba ingiro mbuza ibibuzo bibili wa bisatu. Ibikwatana na kuti obama ni kuti B. So je tunako mu chikola people will start being aware. So when you gonna start seeing people asking them questions about TB kumekoro please temwera likirira mu demo ubuzo obo obo tuya ne chiro manya abantu abasina balooza anti okutuya ne chire nyo chiri nomo Omo tu ya ne chilo, omo koti onkoka, omanyo kolo la chanja urono koti onkoka. Koti onkoka kwe kuno kukuli rapidi okutale kira au. No kolo lo kumalo mwezi mulamba, otu ya na, osana lewe keweza kuruwa dewa achilo wakafuwa. I will be releasing more music starting from January. Yeah, so musically we are doing good as Gagamel. Also, Gagamel would like to tell you that as we speak, we have a few days or a few weeks, maybe two only, to open up the Gagamel Record Studios. This is a studio that is located in Tinda at my old residence. And this studio was supported by the president of Uganda, of course, with the Gagamel uh, Entertainment, to make something, to open up a studio that has all the highest equipment quality by quality and technology. So, we now have a place where we no longer need to go abroad to pay a lot of money to have quality production. I also want to remind you that yes, we also have the best cameras and the best lenses in East Africa. You cameramen, you know what I call anamorphic and you know what I call Ari Alexa. Those cameras are in Ntinda at the Gagamel Records so right now uganda we stand a better opportunity to take south africans and nigerians for a ride musical and we are going to also focus on women empowering women in the next two weeks we are going to open up a line where we are going government is going to take on 20 women 20 Bagenda kumera supported by TB every other year. So chitekeza wanama ulile. Tuina okuyamba TB. Kubanga TB ulile ya tanso tuyamba. Katia wala wani na kozi sobu sento kufawa. Mo TB 
Kachitegeza next year mba neta gesende kwa mumanyi music simu wangu. Aliko ya ringa ili ntuminji nyo. So, 20 women will be uh, brought. Tuja kwa tuwaguli exactly how we are going to do it. But they have to be in Gagamel by the 20th of January. Uh, empowering women, ye key factor ya fiesoka. Na inga that doesn't mean we depower men. Because uh, when you empower women, the question is, will men understand a, a woman with power? Because uh, so we are not putting out men, we are also saying we will also give men a chance. So definitely in the record company we will have uh, male artists also, uh, who we have already started on their journey. Uh, I'm proud to say that my son Alan is one of the directors of uh, Gagamel Studios. And I'm also proud to introduce to you Ronnie Mutabazi, please stand up, who is now uh, the artist manager locally. Uh, uh, again, allow me to introduce to you Andrew Chizito, who is the business manager for the artist, Bebe Poo. Um, I am a TB Ngoburu Wade, Nari Ndiao, Nemfinakasimu, Okuvewo Mwami Unantudewa, Nwameta Dr. Esiko. Dr. Esiko, he is representing uh, uh, TB, uh, Stop TB Partnership. Stop TB Partnership, he come to me, Rwani Sa TB Monsiona, he really wamune Stop TB, he Jennifer. Na kuwela na namba Bebe Kulu, tumade tusawa, ukogira kona awe, tuwa galo championi inge, TB. Ne mvuli za ungo muhimbi, mumpa meka, Dr. Yaseka, na mpira nga nange mbutufu nda vila daratiri kasenti na nchi nyonyora mmaneja andu manja andu na namba bebe hivi nituwe visinga vieta goku wa matu decision no jikola ngo mazoku wa matu tuwa situka netugeenda mufisi ya doktor doktor na atu itira mbulichimu na emu kutu itira mbulichimu ngeri feje tuli awe mitime minafu nafu mugaga mereno tuli wa mitima minafu nafu na muamba hati ya yugere chini tunagamati avantu we Uganda today aba fa enyo ebyendwa de kati TB ya kulembede loli silimi yali asimo kutaba abantu na kati TB ya asimo kutaba abantu ne mubuza kijja kitya nanzi jukiza anti jukira anti omuntu wabo mulwadde wa silim tetekeza anti silim ya muta wabafu no endwa de ndala ze zikola chi ze zimota ninayo ne mutabani wange wano uh, jangu miyomba Recently, to our day, of course, World AIDS Day, which is 1st December. Moyombo no Gwemula wa, diangu wa ni mwega wa. Iyomuku wana la kagamela, metuina avalua deba HIV, ilanga Moyomba, yalwala TB, na alwana na ye. Moyomba, tuwa dena ye, ya vayo dana ye wayo public na 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 banga, ayagaraba na Uganda wa manye, uvula dewa slim, na uvula dewa TB. Tula vila mpola Moyomba, tumuza mwa manye, to uh, enough family, each one is a young boy. Mulwadde was sitting, Nayatim Chala was sitting what they were sitting. I think of Avana Babi. Dimutu Basatu Avan, Nay Avana Balam, Nom Chala, Muram. So Chichuachi Kugamanti, a bit of your good day. Tevieta Gansuni, Tevieta discrimination. Kubanga, Katimo discriminating Amyumba, Om Chala Muram, Avana Balam. Which take it? But I think Thank you so much. So now, Wacho, Doctor Netunumia, Andrew Netfumako, and Boyu Katono, Nangamba, Mani Bebe, to call a new into Eviamba, much to Chicola, Chicotagana government, to Yamba and to Uganda. Netuingira Munda, the Chica Bill, and the two kids of Kola, Ne Doctor Isiko, Kuchin to Chat TV. Ya detewali kasente. Nenzida mune neto olola, neto olola, doktor, nemu eto olole vivu uzo, ngeli jenyi nzo kufuna mwa kasente. Nanga andi bebe mwe yogele na kusente, hawa zungu wakuduse. Gwezileto zwa wala lana ye gwengo mtu, wakusugilo kuwati, okudiza. Nengamba kale fine, ogomungugu kankolechi, kangweti. Kwa seo ni wanyawe ne tukenda mu Amerika, meeting ye ya high level, ya limuwa bakule mbezi rensi yona, na 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 ba gabi besente ba na nini zo nini sawa lo kuwa kuwa kali mingabo mumani akati abakuru nevan pita mabali 
Neva ngamba, ibe bi yokedo sobolo biko la nembaga man sobola bwe muva mnyambi ne muta veramu ono kaska mugua avera mu mu ministrizi ova mu mozi office direct kare neva ngamba gorwa chito tu sava sente ngabwe sobolo biko la directly kwe kubanti kati tu tu sewa no nempandi ka proposal proposal neva jita mu neva jiki disa neva ngamba tu agala kusoka kugezesa umwa kugusoka. Nenga chiba singo kungeze sa bamboo za challenge tini za agenda wa nemba gama nchaba na Uganda tiba ina chiba mani kuti b bana farali mavega umtu yambe musiri kiri leko farali mavega ba discussinga ba seba ba ba discussinga umtu yambe mfurume muko so ne bamboo za challenge nemba gama nchaba na Uganda tiba ina chiba mani kuti b. Na ye tuvera tutiala na Uganda nga tetumanyi ko TB nti akta abantu okusinga ne siri mu lero. Kila ganti fe tutali responsible. So ne ne bakiriza plan zange ne balanze ya kuitira microphone na music. Manyiti music mu kwana gwa banna maulire. Bwe mumpa sente za bayimbi ne za banna maulire ne tutefe tujja kutambuza ekintu kyafu. Ne bangamba kale katukugeze sena katono kubanga ine nsine ne toyinza kumpa milioni emune ekitundu ya ya milioni emune ekitundu no loza anti naji kafaringa no na eba ngeze sana bo balabe obatu inaje tusobola kola che okwekole ne batsindi ke Vietnam ne tusula ke mikono na emukusula ke mikono ne batu yigiriza chichi che basubira na emukumalize ra ne mbaza yo ne mbagamba ebi bimbadde mukole emyaka jonna bibale mie okufuna mu result nze ranzi ze yo kuchange ngabwe nchiwoza ngabwe nsobola kuteka information mu mitwe yachi yabantu bwe mansobola kuyimba waya waya ekigambe kitaina ke kitegeza abantu ne bakiwulira then uruwe banne na tv twachi te bawulira ne basirika ne bateka ko mukono kwenda gano aya mwana ne nkwata cheke ne ninye ndege so mukusaba kwange mbino byonna Bili nti emyaka jemba demu Uganda chenjize chidi nti Okudiza abantu obo kwa gale nsi ya fe Chitu singira okwe ya gale za weka Ate nawe kenyini onyumi lovu lamu Kumanga tuwa na stress Njaka la kusaba wana mauli Munega teko tukule fena Sinza kumana sentezi wa matiza mwena Ate la sizirina na ye manyiwe zili Muli wafu kama to ati mwagala nyo senti Na wafu zisa na mwani kei mikono Abamu ne mjika kukua wanuansi Na imba linzi Nga tumazewa <laughs> Na imba saba Na tekete ensimbi wezini Ensimbi nzoge la kolo ansonga Nze pepe kuru siku wakuma bali I don't beat around the bush Siku wakuma kakabila vila bali Ngenda kunsonga Abafu kama nonya chakola Basoboro kuhela u and bana mauli de Uganda na boba antu ateba vuka na boba nonya chepa funamu so ovanga kumusaji agenda yena ala bensimbi wezini yena jana akugama atimuje tukende tuzikoleji tuzichime yu so nsala na kusanga bebe kuru chengu zelua chemi hake jojona kuma fetuli organized an organized person and sumo kula nika project sama kumi habili umurundi kumu na yu chokula nenda chiku gamba huyendi Ndiyate mwenangi kemanya manji na ibifuwa vinu vyo na Ndiyoko mkula na ama gezi jege yongiru Adewe gege yongiru ngo solving a disease Katiku enzo kuwa mto na enchi watu ni mutasora kumukua Echa edi kenzo Dilisa nduoza wechitia kupembe kuru Okufeda aluanye nyo utalo mengo mtu Okumela respected wa music industry Oma ifa ba imbi abasoka usiku tetoa kala kuli respectinga ba imbi bato na yenzo skuwa kale we respect you kulefe na ya respect no more respect na yenzo music aspect into you are coming ah we look so kumunda ganti you are coming kwa na angeti chibu zochiba nda kwa na yuganda ba ambuza tulage into you are coming nze na mali miaka na miaka kanga sa kuli ni mugenzi fili wa imbi over eli wa mali over the star of boy bola kuna tena star of book yeti ali na mui na yenzi ze netrovinga paka katinawe ngamu na mauli otuke bali nunga na yetu yimibi ya singa mwigani which is true so no way to edi akambo dejane ye ye mtu siza bebe kuru wakambi nanti wai akasajia kankambuli le kaluanyo mtalulu wako katusi
Okay. Well, so I guess most of the media um, personalities would enjoy. A couple of years ago, we were in the same place when we decided to help children with uh, heart problems uh, using uh, our concert. We, uh, as Gagamel International, organized one of uh, the biggest concerts in the country. That was uh, the Golden Heart. And through the Golden Heart, we managed to send seven to nine um, children to India for surgery. Those kids had extremely, um, uh, you know, extreme heart issues that could not be worked on here in Uganda. And we are very happy to say that they all returned safely after the operations. Two or three of those children went back for their second operations and they came back still healthy and those families are sorted. As Amber Heart Foundation, we became so proud and we decided to continue and uh, create partnerships with whoever wants to give back or even government. So one of those times we get a call from um, Dr. Isiko, who is seated next to me, uh, who is the representative for uh, Stop TV Uganda. Stop TV is a world uh, uh, organization that it takes charge of uh, tuberculosis, actually right now with the theme and TB, asking me as an artist to champion tuberculosis. It is always difficult for musicians to agree to work for free because the first question from me to Dr. Isiko was, Doctor, am I being paid and how much? What is the limit? I'm sending my uh, invoice you and my proposal. And the doctor said, no, baby, we want you to help us. And um, we sat with the, the management and they said, OK, you know what? Even if we don't want to do, but let's go listen to what they have to say. So we had a conversation with doctor at Stop TV offices. And it was interesting that the doctor happened to tell Bebe Kool and team that actually Ugandans don't know, even you Bebe Kool don't know that TB, tuberculosis, is now killing more people than HIV is. And it is unfortunate that even the uh, media fraternity in Uganda actually won't believe it, that they don't know that people are dying more of tuberculosis than HIV. That is the line that made me pick up interest. So when I picked up the interest, I asked them what they wanted me to do or what I'm expected of. We ended up in New York where I met uh, uh, the bosses of money. I usually call them the bosses of money because all problems are sorted with money. And uh, I was given an opportunity to express myself, and I, I told them clearly, I don't know much about tuberculosis. I don't even know. The first time I heard about TB is a month ago when Dr. Isiko called me and told me he wants me to champion TB. So that means there's a missing gap in our countries, most especially in Uganda, when it comes to awareness, which is promotion. Awareness is so key. That was my point. So from that day onwards, I connected awareness to finances. Because these people keep talking about the big amounts of money they have on their accounts. Because world uh, organizations, companies, and countries keep contributing money so that Global Fund or TB Rich can use that money to fight diseases in the world. But we always, most of the time, just hear about money, 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 money. And it doesn't come to play. So that was my argument in New York. Later on, I got a, um, um, a message that asked me to join the big shots and have a private discussion. They were asking me, how would I engage if they gave me money? I told them, me, the most important thing is as long as you get bureaucracy out of my way, I'll be able to help. So bureaucracy is the fact that things are done in a specific way. So even if there's an emergency, there won't be a twist around because it was organized like that, because it is meant to be like that in the ministry. You understand? So for me, I told them, diseases don't program when they will attack and they don't program when they will kill. So for me, the best way to help you here is when I have the power 
to make the decisions at the right time when the diseases are a problem. And I think it made them very, very interested in Bebe Kuhu. So from that day up to today, I was asked to be part of the people who apply for a grant and I was asked to show them what I can do with the grant. So as uh, Amber Heart Foundation, we knew we were good at uh, giving and helping and, and giving back to the community. So we came back and uh, did a proposal. Ladies and gentlemen, the proposal later on was uh, accepted by uh, uh, TB Rich. TB Rich is the, are the guys who give you the money in this country or in these countries to fight tuberculosis. Those are some of the guys who give you the money. So we are lucky, recently we were told uh, we'll go to Vietnam and continue to, to defend our proposal. And lucky enough, our defense was perfect because uh, we, we stuck with what we thought was right. We stuck to awareness. Ugandans don't have a single idea about how dangerous tuberculosis is today in the country. Neither does the media fraternity, which is supposed to tell the Ugandans what is on the ground. So we won, and uh, ladies and gentlemen, we're very lucky. Let's say thanks to TB Rich. They gave us $400,000 to operate as an example for the first year. So they can see what we are capable of as Amber Heart, Stroke, Uganda media, and Ugandan people. They are sister, we have two sister groups that were also given the same amount of money, only that then they are dealing with, with uh, 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 tuberculosis in a different angle, okay? But we will definitely work together. But this one, because it was all about awareness, our key issue was about awareness, about people knowing. Yes, we are also going to deal with some case findings, but our issue is Ugandans to wake up, Ugandans to put tuberculosis at the front. Yesterday, AIDS was at the front, but the fact is today, TB is at the front. So, we are happy that we came back uh, with that good news and we want to, we would like to ask Ugandans, most especially the media fraternity, to join us in the next 12 months on the journey of letting people know the dangers and fighting tuberculosis. Um, today, we definitely will focus 70% of the press conference on TB and then 20% uh, we will focus on Bebe Kuhu, and then 10% will focus on the media. One of the things that most people do by mistake is they don't give media an, a, a share on the table. Today, you definitely have a share on the table because uh, uh, you play a very big role. And whatever I'm going to do in the next 12 months, you need to back me up. There's nothing we can do as Ugandans unless if we work together. There's no way I or the government of Uganda is going to fight diseases unless if we work together. Now, for me, my issue is simple. Most of the people have, an, have this thing, a, 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 a thought that it is a shame to have tuberculosis. It's, no, it is not. That's where I begin from. So I want to get TB away from that shame, the darkness, onto a table of discussion. It is just okay. It is a disease that can be treated. It is unbelievable that Ugandans don't know that TB is treated for free. If a disease is treated for free, actually it is also so embarrassing that Ugandans don't know that tuberculosis can be cured. So for me, when I add the aspect of saying TB kills more people than HIV, and then I add the other aspect of saying treatment for tuberculosis is free all over Uganda, and then I add the aspect that TB can cure, then the mistake is between me, the celebrity who has the ears of the people, and you, the media fraternity, who transpose the news to the people. So my prayer here comes. I think with those three combinations, we have something good to do back for the country. I was talking to one of my friends here from Bukele, they have been working for the last 15 years, uh, 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 Nijo. I was telling Nijo, Nijo, every other time you get, you get, you get, you get, what have you given back to the people as an individual? What have you done for your country for sure? He said, but you as an individual, what have you done? 
So, Nijo, I had to try and, you know, uh, and then all of a sudden decided to listen. So, here when I talk about Nijo, I'm trying to talk to you as, as media personalities. And this is not political, this is not anything, but this is common sense for sure. What have you done for your country as an individual? Yes, we demand a lot from the government, we demand a lot from the people, but you as the media, at least let's do the health things. Let's leave the others, don't promote the music, don't do what, eh? but let's do something for the country when it comes to health. Um, 